Okay, so moving along with your project, you have two sets of data in here. Yours are going to be sorted by adults and children for one particular category, like sodium or calories or fat, whatever column you chose, but you'll have a column for adults and a column for uh, children. Mine are G and C by manufacturer. It's a different set of data. You won't see the same data, but this is the same idea. So the next thing you, I want you to do is to highlight both sets of data. So you're going to highlight that and then you're going to come up here and click on multiple variable analysis to create two box plots side by side. Um, your first box plot is your A on the top and your then your B on the bottom. So you, we're going to create those. You're going to do a print screen, uh, copy, put them into uh, paint or whatever you're doing again and label those so I know which one is adult, which one is children, and what you chose, like sodium for adult or sodium for children. Notice that I am showing the outliers here because I'm going to have you talk about whether you have any outliers in your data, so make sure that you show outliers when you do this. Also, if you want to click on the settings to show whether you're showing outliers or not, you can do that. But you can also click on this uh, sigma up here. And my screen is kind of off here. I can go down a little bit and show you. Then it would show you what your mean and standard deviation and minimum and maximum and so forth. If you wanted to have those to know where those are, if you're going to answer questions about them, it's good to know that. So. I should have said that too. You want to have those values if you're going to find the outliers in your fences. All right, that's all for this video.